Yo, yo, yo. Good day, good day, good day, everybody. Thank you so much for joining and listening uh, and taking the time to be a part of the journey with us here over at Easy Does It. You already know we're going to do our daily reflection under five minutes. Please, please leave your comments. We want to hear what you, your thoughts are, okay? Title is Getting Well, August 18th, Getting Well. Very deep, sometimes quite forgotten, damaging emotional conflicts persist, persist below the level of consciousness. 12 Steps and 12 Traditions, page 79 and 80. Only through positive action can I remove the remains of guilt and shame brought on by alcohol. Throughout my misadventures when I drank, my friends would say, why are you doing this? You're only hurting yourself. Little did I know how true those words were. Although I harmed others, some of my behaviors caused grave wounds to my soul. Step eight provides me with a way of forgiving myself. I alleviate much of the hidden damage when I make my list of those I have hurt. In making amends, I free myself of burdens, thus contributing to my healing. Man, Yo, all of these that I read, it's just amazing because I feel like it's just coming from me. You know, it hits home. One of the things I've battled for a long time is how, you know, I know God has forgiven me. My wife has forgiven me. But what do you do when you can't forgive yourself, man? And it's only till recently that I've learned about this making the list and you know, making amends gradually. And it just, it truly does free. It's been freeing me of uh, these burdens, man. It, it almost, uh, it's like it's getting down to the root and start picking at it from the root. And I'm able to loosen it and almost, it almost it's, it's, I'm almost really free, man. But what do you do? You know, it's we've hurt so many people, but ultimately we've hurt and we've hurt ourselves. The drinking, who did it hurt? Yeah, we've are some of the actions we've had has caused a lot of hurt to others, but we've hurt ourselves, man. So listen, man, everyone makes mistakes. It's a natural part of being human, man. But forgiveness starts with recognizing that we are imperfected. We are imperfected beings, man, and it's part of life. Sometimes it takes longer for us to realize that and, you know, being stuck in, in some kind of addiction just adds on to the time. Now, you guys, just like me, I've battled. If you're battling it, man, yo, it's, it's forgiveness is a gift. So if you have the opportunity, <clears throat> excuse me, to seek out forgiveness, writing that, that list, get, uh, getting amends. That's where it all begins. It's just apologizing and saying, yo, I wasn't in the right place of mind. Please forgive me. And whether they forgive you or not, you and yourself, just your actions are causing uh, you to learn how to forgive yourself. You know, and just like they, the people that we've hurt deserve compassion, you yourselves deserve compassion. You know, and I'm learning all of this. This is all new to me as well. I mean, I've, it's taken me a long while to learn this, you know, And but ultimately we focus on the present, everyone. The present is today. Don't be overwhelmed that somebody didn't forgive you. Don't be overwhelmed with the past. You don't have to be stuck in your addiction. And just remember, you don't have to do it just for today. Just get, get it done for today. And when all else, when it's going crazy and you're overwhelmed, Whoa, whoa, easy does it there, all right? Easy does it. Thanks, drop a comment, subscribe, pass this along. Many of us deal with addiction or have dealt with addiction. And remember, addiction begin with trauma, all right? So we'll see you next time, okay? Peace.